How does your L&D program compete with Google and Siri? Hi, welcome to the Let's Talk Talent channel where we discuss the world of HR and talent management. We're here to help you unlock the potential in your people. So if you're anything like me, when I'm trying to solve a problem or learn a new skill, I'm more likely to log on to Google and ask it or even talk to Siri. So Siri, how do I change a light bulb? Well, as L&D professionals, we're actually competing with both Google, Siri, and even AI um, technology. So how do you make your L&D program really come alive for your people? Now, the first thing is stop competing with Google and Siri because you can never compete with that global market. But what you can do is take it back to first principles. So use your marketing brain. Think about it from an audience perspective. What does your business need? and ultimately your audience need to be successful to drive high performance. And that's linked to your business strategy. What are the new skills, experiences, training that are essential to being a high performer in your organization? But your audience is going to want something different. They're gonna want bite-sized learning. They're not gonna to want to sit in rooms for days learning complicated processes. They're gonna to want to go onto your LMS and go, here's a cheat sheet. Tell me in 10 minutes how I can get better performance feedback. They might want to go on to a webinar that might be 90 minutes. They might want to have a video from a manager talking about feedback. So think about the different channels in which you're evoking that performance in your people. So stop competing with Google and Siri and think about it from an audience perspective. What do they want and what do they need? Magic comes together when you put it into context. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more useful HR and talent management video content. Hope you enjoy this video. See you next time.